Last year, I think it was good, but 2021, it needs to be even better. What's up, you guys? Welcome back to my channel. Happy Boxing Day, YouTube world. Well, is it actually Boxing Day? Because online it said Monday is Boxing Day. Oh, sorry, I'm a day uh, too early, but happy Saturday. Two days, then, if that's the case, right? I don't know. I'm asking you, Mom. You don't have to talk in that voice, Mom. I'm asking you. Like, is Monday? <laughs> well, we are going to hit some stores this morning just to do a little bit of shopping nothing crazy i have a list of things that i want to get basically i'm just trying to prepare for the new year and then later me and my mom are going to have a meeting alexa chantel meeting to plan for 2021 yes exciting and y'all might think we're doing the most but <laughs> no but we're taking this thing serious i believe in my daughter's vision i believe in her talent i believe in her skills and so um i want to just you know make sure she has the perfect foundation, a good foundation, so that all she has to do is capitalize on the things that she's good at and just have a good time and build her business the right way. So that's what we're gonna do. We gotta enjoy yeah. it. So I'll try to film some of that process because I think 2021, we're definitely going to take Lexa Chantel brand and business more seriously, have quarterly meetings maybe, yeah, perfect. or something like that. I don't know, we'll see. <laughs> all this talk at the beginning of the year, but yeah, hopefully planning out our yearly goals, our quarterly goals, and and our tactics to achieve them so I'll try to film some of that I don't want to give away all of the goals because I don't feel like it's good to tell everyone every single one of your goals because sometimes people don't have your best interest at heart it's like you also don't have to let everybody yeah, into you think, you what you got planned anything. it's like when people be like I'm moving in silence hey everybody I'm moving in silence like it's like okay just do what you got to do you don't got to let people know <laughs> right, right, exactly. but what God has for you is for you and when you come with what I call love, truth, and and genuine focus. I mean, the 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 sky is not even the limit. You can go beyond that. So yeah. I'm not worried about people. I'm just um, you know, excited to see you. Just have a good time with your yeah. with your process. So comment down below what role you think my mom should have in the company after hearing her speak. <laughs> Um, you know, my husband has tried to demote me on several occasions, but you know, <laughs> it's just not working. Yeah, because my dad also thinks he's a part of the management team. So we'll just see what 2021 has planned out. But yeah, it's going to be a great year. So we are just going to get this day going. So yeah, you guys, let me know what kind of videos and content you want to see from the Lexa Chantel channel in 2021. All right, guys. So we are about to start our first business meeting for 2021 yeah. okay so my mom put together this very beautiful it's a template for your strategic plan yeah like a business plan template yeah on this template that we're gonna walk through um she created different sides so we have like what is your mission she already started putting some information in here that we've talked about in the past but like what is my mission for the brand, my vision, um, my plan to grow sales this year, as well as like my marketing plan, how I'm gonna promote my channel each quarter, um, different product and content development ideas that I'm planning to help grow my channel this year. We can insert by quarter. And then um, different brands or different um, like affiliates or influencer work that I want to achieve or work with this year and then she has a little 2021 subscriber and sales projections slide which is probably not super realistic but I mean hey as you guys can see she has me hitting almost 20,000 subscribers next month <laughs> if you put in the work you'll get the results maybe not always because YouTube is a little funny algorithm but yeah, so not really going to spend too much time um, sharing all of the screen recording with you guys as we're doing it because I want to make sure that we are focusing on this meeting. But wanted to give you guys a little bit of insight on what we were talking about here. We are talking about um, Lexa Chantel, the brand being like um, an umbrella brand for everything you like to do, which you said that, mm -hmm. but I absolutely love, that makes perfect sense. Like when I say your gifts, like what are some of the things you said that you like to do, you love to do? Because with the Lexus Chantel brand, it's going to be an umbrella brand 
that showcases, you know, some of the things that you enjoy doing. So what are the easiest, most fun, exciting things that are just natural for you to do that you want to share? Talk. So I want to continue my Let's Talk series where I just come on camera and be my candid self. Talking candidly. Um, also, I feel like I'm really creative, so lots of times DIY projects come easy to me and I execute them pretty much good every single time. So that's something that mm -hmm. I think comes natural to me. So if I have the opportunity to um, do more DIY projects and home decor things this year, mm -hmm. which I think we should be able to, mm -hmm. I think that's a win. Yeah, I wanna continue to create content and art. I love that. Because art is not something people have really seen from you, but it is a facet that is fun, exciting, and you may be able to translate it into, like you said, home decor. Okay. So your um, mission is going to be to create content and art um, that you uh, can share with the world. The world. Just want the channel to grow and be mm -hmm. um, like a successful channel. I want my channel to have good engagement, not just subscribers, but also high engagement. So like in, an engaged audience that like, you know, feels like a close knit audience of people that support my channel. I like that. Mm -hmm. Because it's one thing to have the numbers, but if people don't watch your stuff or watch it thoroughly or engage and leave comments and stuff, it doesn't really mm -hmm. mean that you have a successful channel. You know, you mm -hmm. just have subscribers. For um, you know, the dot com for blogging purposes. Mm -hmm. Um, what are your thoughts there? Yeah, that's what I wanted to do. Cause I, like I said, I bought the domain last year. Mm -hmm. I've been paying on it every month. I need to check to make sure. But I do want to like have a better system for translating my YouTube videos into vlogs, at least for the backfield ones, because mm -hmm. that should be easy to to do to get more um, get more data, I guess, behind the vlogs because they'll have the opportunity to rank more in like search results if I can get some of those going. And then from there, I think I, I think you can use AdSense, Google AdSense with AlexisShinto.com and you can get ads on your blogs, mm -hmm. um, which could be another you know thing to tap into. Because I know some bloggers and I've watched YouTube videos on it and maybe depending on how well I can do with that, that could be another like series that I do of talking about my experience if I can like grow that blog aspect because some people are full-time bloggers you know mm -hmm. and they make their money just from doing blogs mm -hmm. so i think that's something i want to expand into because i feel like it could complement my youtube channel mm -hmm. nicely All right getting to page number nine the marketing plan mm -hmm. for q1 okay so what is your marketing plan to grow lexus chantel via youtube in 2021 right now you have advertised weekly via other social media outlets to drive traffic to the youtube channel and you were talking about the sponsored ads, but probably wouldn't tap into that. Okay, so we'll take that off. As much. Yeah. As you guys know, I do digital advertising as a livelihood. That's my full-time job. And I just feel like for the purpose of my brand and my channel right now, it's not the smartest or the best avenue to tap into right now um, with doing Google advertising for YouTube for my channel just because it takes a lot of money to to advertise and I feel like it just, the return would be horrible for my channel right now. So we are going to take that off and not tap into that this year. Yeah, advertising weekly on other social media outlets. Yeah, I need to do better. I mean, it's just, I need to find the best way to go about it because I honestly don't think that I want to do the recaps like I used to. It just, like I said, it didn't give me the best return. I would do like 30 second to one minute recap videos for Instagram specifically, just showing different clips of a video that I just posted, posted on my feed and be like, hey, like this is my new video. But what I found specifically for my Instagram was that like, I would look at the insights. I would not get a lot of traffic um, of people showing that they have clicked on the link to my bio um, to get to the YouTube video and then when looking at my YouTube analytics, I barely had any traffic coming from outside sources like Instagram. So I stopped doing it because it would take some time to like recreate those and reformat them and I just felt like it was a waste. But I do think maybe I need to grow my Instagram followers to at least 10,000 because then I can start putting the link on the stories 
because right now I have to guide people to say, go navigate to my page and click on the link opposed to like swipe up and hit this link because I don't have enough followers, you know? Mm -hmm. So maybe I would see different results mm -hmm. then okay. if I was able to incorporate that feature. Lastly, 2021 subscriber and sales projection. Mm -hmm. um, we have for Q1, we are thinking that we are going to end Q1 with 30,000 subscribers. That's doubling the subscribers we have now in the next three months. Mm -hmm. Do you think that's attainable? I feel like if by March we're not there, then we can start making adjustments. But I feel like being our stretch goal. Yeah, exactly right. Um, okay. And it's okay um, if we have to adjust. You know, this thing is, you know, is easy to to modify. So that's that's not an issue. And seventy five thousand by December. So what which is it's attainable. It's just you never know what happens with YouTube. Right. Honestly, I could have over a hundred thousand by July. You really could. Like you never know what YouTube, like some people grow, like they blow up. Mm -hmm. You know, we are setting, we're gonna still say that these are um, stretch, goal. stretch goals, but also conservative at the same time because we don't wanna limit ourselves and think that we can't attain this because mm -hmm. we can. But it's also like coming from where we are right now, it does seem like a stretch goal when you look at the data, but let's shoot for even more. Yeah, so we'll have a separate meeting or maybe after this talking about the content plan, because I think planning out Vlogmas was super helpful for me mm -hmm. um, to know what types of content I was mm -hmm. gonna put out. So maybe we can plan something for January, just our list of ideas, select a few, mm -hmm. and then I get you know going. You know, you're having a good time with it. You know, although it's a lot of work, like it's, it's not easier than a, a, a regular job mm -hmm. because you are the designer, you are the strategic planner, you are the one executing so it's like a lot is on your shoulder just to develop a 10 minute video that people will you know find entertaining or inspiring but it's going to be up to you to have high quality um you know camera work lighting content mm -hmm. um all of that so that people when they're sitting back they feel like it's worth their time yeah last year i think it was good but 2021 it needs to be even better okay guys so that is our first 2021 business meeting thanks for joining me you're more than welcome you are phenomenal thank to, you to um work with i love that you listen i love that you have good ideas and that's what it takes yep so we are now going to get off camera and start planning into the nitty-gritty of January so that we are ready to take it by its horns. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video to watch what I did today and our business meeting. And yeah, what else, mama? That's it. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up. Um, comment down below. What should they comment down below? Yeah, comment down below. 2021, here we come. I may do a separate video talking about my personal 2021 goals i don't know yeah. we'll just we'll just see what we have planned but thank you guys for watching up to this point um subscribe to my channel if you're not already turn on your post notifications to be updated every time i upload and follow me on instagram okay thanks for watching and listening to my mom in the background <laughs> bye guys <laughs>